Hey everyone, welcome back to episode 11 of Orspawn Adventures. And this here is Spyro. That's right guys, he grew up, he's a full size dragon now. He can fly just as well as anything else. Oh, the red ones are getting out again. And... Here's the cool part. That's right, we can fly with him. And I'll remember not to hit the left shift button. So this right here is where I'm thinking about building. That's right, he's got fireballs and explosive fireballs if you want to use them. So you can actually fight while you're on his back. So I like the lay of the land here. We're definitely going to build right in here. And where was that? There it is. So that's the dungeon that it is. It is a wasp dungeon. I'm going to get off right here. I want to pick up all this stuff here. Mostly because it might come in handy. Now I don't think... There's no way we're strong enough to take on those wasps over there. So what we'll do is we'll just pick up all this stuff. A little bit of more butter candy. There's so much gold. And there are chests galore. Ah. Stupid mosquitoes. Okay, so. Backpack needs to be here. So I can put this, 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 and those guys in. Because we don't need those. Where'd you go, buddy? Come here. Oop, sorry. Alright, so we'll fly back home here. Dismount is always a challenge. Hey. Hey, don't be. Hey. Ah, <laughs> oh, Spyro. Had to set me on fire. What the heck? You're not supposed to be able to get in here. Well, apparently, though, we'll cross through. Oh, I suppose he jumped up on a block. Okay, so, our bed. Yeah, the ants are jumping up on there. I'll have to put some glass in or something. Alright, so let's sleep the night away. Um, that didn't work.
Okay, so why are we not able to sleep? So apparently, in the mining dimension, you can't sleep. That makes my bed useless. Okay, we have an Allosaurus here. So let's take him on. Okay, so he died. He died. Not exactly sure where the Allosaurus fell to. You got plenty of health, but you're okay. Alright, so I think we're gonna look take a look at heading down here. Although we got some nasties down there. I wish I could find a Mothra. So I would really like some better armor. Plus, that's also our first step in our quest here. Hey, buddy. Goodbye. See that dynamic lighting is doing the same thing here, where it, it sees that light. Ooh, a T-Rex. Mothra. Let's take it down. Come back here. Alright guys, we're fighting Mothra here. We're gonna catch up to him and we're gonna take him down. There he is. I can't hit him. Okay, he's coming this way. And we got him. Okay, that got crazy in a hurry. But we got him, man. We got him. Alright, guys. So, that is probably the easiest mob. The easiest of the bosses to kill. By a long shot. So, don't think that I got away easily here because well I did get away easily but that it's always going to be like this because it's not oh man he dropped stuff everywhere alright guys we did it we took down Mothra and I think it's time we got everything. We got all the drops. Oh gosh. I think that's Mothra again. I I've never seen more than like one or maybe two of them in a night. So to see if that's a third one. To see three of them, that's just crazy. Alright, so the reason it was a lot easier is because for one thing I had the bow. The bow makes a huge difference. Okay, that, was, that was a lot of explosions. I have a feeling Mothra is fighting something because that, that is a lot of explosions. Oh shoot! lighting stuff on fire Spyro I mean seriously he's lighting everything on fire oh there's an ender thing there I don't want to really 
get him. Okay, so let's show you this awesome stuff here. Let's show you what I can do. We got 23 scales. We also got three blaze rods out of it and a bunch of gold ingots again. Okay, so the gold goes up, blaze rods goes up. Oh, and another cube in that. We won't use the item frame yet, but we will hang them up later. So, we've got the helmet. Oh, you know what? We're not going to have enough. We've got that. We'll make pants, and we are literally one scale short of making our boots. How about that? The scales can go up here. And I'm going to replace some of this stuff here. We'll keep the boots, but this stuff can go up here. What am I doing? And there we are. We've got some of our pretty awesome armor here. So, what does it have? Well, it's got protection, fire protection, blast protection on all of it. These are really good for fire protection. And the boots, if I make them, will have um, feather falling. There you are, buddy. I saw you coming. Alright, so I guess night is, or day is coming. The dawn is arriving. I think we should go watch it. We took out Mothra. What I'm going to do, is we're going to sit here. See if we get a red ant coming here. Alright guys, this is what it's all about. Alright. Okay, we set somebody off. Um, I don't know where he is. There he is. We lit him on fire, he'll run away. Alright, so let's go take a look at building our stairs. Hot. That creeper got his butt kicked. Okay, so I know there was some water here. I'm just going to ride the water down. Okay, it's over there. Well, maybe it's not as accessible as I originally thought. It would be kind of neat to go here and like build a bridge across at some point. In fact, I might just do that. Okay, so we're going to put some stairs in here. I'm just going to make some single stairs here. Uh, I knew that was going to happen. get some dirt here um, we don't need our backpack at the moment all right so this is basically what I'm gonna be doing for a little while here so I will make you guys watch oh shoot I will make you guys watch this. All 
But it makes it much easier to get back up and down. Much easier to see what's going on. Alright, I still can't get over the fact that we killed Mothra. We did awesome, guys. Alright, so what I'm probably going to do from here is it'll take a right turn. And we're actually going to start digging through here. We're going to go underneath the lava. Just because we can. And we'll end up putting... Actually, I'm going to have to dig probably more of it out because we're going to put stairs in here. But you get the picture. We'll head out that way, so... I'll clean it up as I come back up with the stairs. Hopefully my pick survives this. The cool part is, since we're using... The emerald pick we're pulling up stone at the same time we can turn it into lots of different things and I have decided we will be building a castle down below so a castle is my decision so it's gonna take some stone for the outer walls for our defenses I'm not sure how big I'm going to make them or what, but I want to do stone. And then I think the inside's going to be wood. And I have a trick when it comes to doing that. And I will be showing you guys that in a later episode. So I think with that, Spyro's having fun up there doing something. So yeah, we're underneath the lava according to the map. So that guys, I am going to finish up the episode here. Thank you guys for checking out this video. If you like this series, please leave a comment about any suggestions you might have. And definitely subscribe to my channel. So I'll see you guys next time.